Good morning to you. It's a beautiful Tuesday. How are you? H how are you really doing? Well, I'm glad you're here today. Um, yesterday I talked about um, standing still. When you've done all you can, just stand still. But on this Tuesday, there is a time in which God gives you the green light and it's time to, to move forward. Um, but still, there are those times in which you're to stand still. And But before you stand still, you do all you can do. And there are times you wake up in the morning and quite frankly, you could be overwhelmed. Your list could be a mile long and you could be overwhelmed too for other reasons. Uh, your health, your finances, your marriage, uh, your spirituality, your emotional state. Um, there's a number of things that can just overwhelm you. Maybe it's your children or your grandchildren you're concerned about. Or maybe you're having car trouble. Or maybe your roof is leaking or you've got plumbing issues. There's, uh, again, so many things that can overwhelm us. And uh, we're good. Uh, you know, we're strong people. And uh, we've come through a lot already. But still, there are times in life in which we're just overwhelmed. What do you do? What do you do when you're overwhelmed before you've done all you can do? Well, there's a few things that maybe you can still yet do. Number one is you can pray. Number two, you can get some word in you. Go to the, go to the Word of God, read the Bible, and uh, get you some fresh word in you, some fresh manna, give you some spiritual nutrition. You can get up and uh, bathe and shave and comb your hair and brush your teeth. That always makes you feel better. Uh, again, that's something you can do. And there's other things, too, that you can do. Um, and if you don't know what to do, uh, maybe take the next step. Uh, you know, just do what you can. Uh, it may be a, something small. It may be so small, like getting up in the morning and, uh, and getting yourself ready for the day and getting you some coffee, uh, getting you a little nutrition in your stomach as well. Uh, just, just, just do the things you can do, and then you believe that God is going to give you the strength to do what else you have to do, and and He'll open doors and He'll close doors. Um, that is, if you have went to the Lord, tell Him, "Hey, I'm overwhelmed. I'm just overwhelmed today. I, I've got so much to do. I've got so much on me. I'm not for sure how much more I can take." Just know this, that God, and I know you've heard this so many times before, God is aware of what you can handle. And uh, and you know what? He will not put upon you any more than you can handle. Um, I, I know, I know you've heard that so many times, but here's the key to that. Make sure, make sure that you're not trying to handle it by yourself. Make sure that you have the Lord Jesus uh, helping you as well. Uh, inviting him aboard your, your storm toss boat. Invite him into your life. Invite him into your situation. God, I know you know, but I need help. I'm overwhelmed. <laughs> I need help. And also it helps as well to have have some friends you can just call up and talk to. Or going outside and walking around or going for a drive. Maybe today you should go fishing. Uh, anything, anything you can do. And there are things you can yet do. But sometimes we feel like we're backed into the corner. We'll look around. Look around, go to God, and then look around. And I think you'll find that God will open some doors for you. He will. He will. God will open some doors for you. He'll make a way. He'll give you your next thing you need to do when the time is right. And so breathe today. Have some coffee. Pray. Read your Bible. Uh, get outside your four walls. Walk around outside. Uh, do what you got to do. There are some things you just have to do, like going to work or uh, feeding the kids, or taking out the trash, whatever it is, whatever it is, do what you can, do what you can, and um, at least you're doing something, and I, you'll feel better because you've made some progress, you've gotten up today, hey, sometimes that's an accomplishment, just getting up, anyway, hey, love you, appreciate you, thank you for watching Coffee with the Pastor, and I hope you have a marvelous Tuesday, and um, I'm always here. If you uh, hey, if you need a prayer, uh, shoot me a text or, or message me, and I'll be happy to, uh, to 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 pray for you. I'll be happy to do that. That's something I can do. I can pray for you, and we can pray for each other. God bless you.